What the fuck? Man, I don't know why I keep having those crazy dreams.
Man, that's really weird. Hey, what's up? Are you busy? I want to come over and tell you something. Alright, man. I'll see you in a little. Oh, hey man, come on in. So, uh, what's up? Remember those nightmares I keep having that I was telling you about? Yeah. Well, last night, I had some of the weirdest ones ever. And the topper was this one, where I woke up and I couldn't move, and this creature was sitting on my chest, choking me. And when I woke up, I had real scratches on my neck. Check it out. Dude, you're, you're kidding me, right? I mean, y you had a bad dream, you scratched yourself in your sleep. I is this what you came to tell me? It didn't really bother me until I actually saw the scratches. It kind of freaked me out, but I guess it is possible I could have done it to myself in my sleep. Well, yeah, what else could it have been? Uh... Did you ever hear about that guy? He was uh, he had this dream, he was eating a giant marshmallow, and then he woke up and his pillow was gone? It's, it's something like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you, you just gotta chill out, you gotta get a, a regular sleeping pattern, and uh, that'll fix your problem right there. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, yeah, well, you know what, um, yeah, I got, I got a lot of stuff to do today, so, uh, you know, as much as I'd like to hang out, I, I got a lot of shit to do. Yeah, alright, and I have to go to work and do some wash afterwards. Alright, man, uh, I'll, I'll see you later then. Alright, see you later.
Can I get a, a good old burger, uh, french fries, and a soda? Anything on the burger? Yeah, could you put cheese on that then? Pickles. All right. I don't believe this shit.
Holy shit. Dude, I was on the internet and I just found out the craziest stuff. All that stuff I told you about, waking up from a nightmare and not being able to move with a figure in black sitting on my chest choking me are actually symptoms of a common thing called sleep paralysis. People have been claiming to experience it for thousands of years and it's always the same thing. Sometimes the people report an old hag, others a shadowy dark figure. It's in all cultures with many stories about the creatures that cause them. Yeah, I know you told me there was a simple explanation, but I thought you would find this interesting. The similarity is amazing. All right, man. I'll talk to you later. Well, I guess I'll finally go do my wash.
There's nothing to be afraid of. It's just a common phenomenon. What the hell? Must be something with the wiring.
What the hell is that? So the light did come back on. Was that thing really in my room? What's happening to me? Hello. Yes, I'd like to make an appointment to see the doctor. All right. Okay, thanks. All right, that'll be good. Thank you. Goodbye. described are the classic symptoms of sleep paralysis. Well, what about the scratches and the hallucinations? Well, you scratched yourself in your sleep. And the hallucinations, well, have you ever heard of hypnagogic imagery? No. Well, when you're falling asleep or waking up, you can experience something which is called hypnagogic imagery. It's kind of like a hallucination or even a waking dream. It's really common and nothing to worry about. The important thing to remember is that sleep paralysis cannot actually hurt you. You will have to remain calm and it will pass. That's easier said than done. Yes, I know, but nobody ever died from a nightmare. Are you currently under a lot of stress, or do you suffer from an erratic sleep schedule? Yes, to both of them. Well, try to reduce your stress and keep a regular sleeping pattern. That should help. And remember, you are not alone. Many people suffer from sleep paralysis.
What the fuck are you looking at?
am I? What is happening? <laughs> You're not real. I'm not afraid of you. You can't hurt me! This is a dream! <laughs> if you're not scared, then why are you running? You're all in my head. It's just a bad dream. Really? It sure seems real to me. You've got a lot to learn. <laughs> You're my dream. I control you. We'll just see about that. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> <laughs>
Hey, <laughs> what's up, man? Hey, are you busy? Can I come in? Yeah, sure. So, I hear you haven't been showing up at work. Yeah, well, I figured I would take some time off until I work some things out. It's hard to concentrate when you haven't had a decent night's sleep in weeks. Dude, what? What's the problem? I thought I thought you had this figured out that it was it was just like that uh that, that, that sleep thing or whatever. Sleep paralysis. And even though I've learned what it is, I haven't stopped it. And it gets worse. It used to be every now and then, but now it's every time I sleep. I can't get rid of it. No matter what I do, I can never rest. You've got to chill out. But what did the doctor tell you? Not much. Just that a lot of people have it and that I need to relax. But I don't get it. It just gets worse. Well, hold on. Let, let me get something for you. I, I know what'll help. Hey, here, take a few of these and you will sleep like the dead. Thanks. Maybe they will help me sleep better. <laughs> hey, no problem, man. I'm just trying to help. You know, we haven't really talked about what happened in a while, but I am really sorry. And if I could do the whole thing over again... <sighs> yeah, uh, look, it's okay. Um... Don't worry about it. You know, you got a lot on your mind. It's, it's all right. I know. I, 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 I just thought it would be good if we talked about it more. <laughs> uh, yeah, you know what? Uh, just don't worry about it. That, it, it. It's in the past. So, uh, anyway, I'd, I'd really like to hang out, but I got a lot of shit to do. So, uh... Yeah, so, you know, the, those pills, uh, th they always help me whenever I can't get to sleep. And, um, you know, these bad dreams, uh, they're just nightmares. They can't hurt you. Well, all right. I, I guess I'll see you later. Yeah, see you later. And maybe these will finally help me get some sleep. I have to remind myself, it's just a dream. Man, I gotta take a piss. Oh, hey man. Good to see you. But how the hell did you get in here? Hey, where are you going?
<laughs> Get out of here! This is my dream! <laughs> Haven't you learned anything yet? There is no difference between waking and dreaming. It's all the same! And there's nothing you can do to stop it. Nothing! Just accept it. You are just a figment of my imagination. <laughs> How do you know you're not a figment of my imagination? Because it's my fucking dream! <laughs> then why can't you control it? You! I'm not afraid of you! This ends now! Come back! I'm not afraid of you! Oh, there you are. So glad I found you. Uh, come on, we gotta go get you home. Dude, what are you talking about? Come on, you've gotta come with me. Yes, come with us. We will take you home. This, this is crazy. Stop. Not much longer. We're almost there. Now hold on, we're, we're here now. No, we must help you rest. Stop. There is nothing you can do. It will never end. No! Maybe I'm approaching this the wrong way. Maybe what I'm experiencing in my dreams is symbolic. Perhaps my unconscious is trying to tell me something. Hmm. This looks interesting. Psychic dream interpreter. Dream reading. Dreams explained and what they mean to you. Well, this sounds like exactly what I'm looking for.
viel. Man, you're not gonna believe this crazy shit. Let me come in and tell you about it. Yeah, all right, come on in. this time I don't know man I don't really know what to make of it I had this idea that maybe I should approach the nightmares in a different way maybe I should try to look at them symbolically perhaps my unconscious was trying to tell me something since I tried going to a doctor and she didn't really help I thought maybe I would try something else and while looking I came across this psychic dream interpreter and that sounded perfect I went to check it out, and when I got there, I practically flipped out when I saw that the psychic guy was the same as this guy that appears in my nightmares. He constantly taunts me. I mean, he didn't just look similar. It was him. No, listen, okay. You saw this guy before. You remembered him subconsciously, and then when you had your dream, you, you just remembered him in your dream and made him... The, the, your tormentor, it's... I don't know, man. I really think there is something more to it. This guy looks pretty peculiar. I think I would have remembered him. And it's the way he acts in my dreams. I mean, he's not just there in the background. It's like he controls them. What about that, uh, that thing in black? I thought that controlled your dream. There is definitely some type of relationship between the two. I don't know what it is, but there is. It's almost like... He is a voice for the black thing. In fact, I wonder if he in some way controls it. Could he be the one causing all this? <laughs> Dude, are, are, are you fucking kidding me? That's insane. I don't know, but it's a pretty big coincidence that this guy is a psychic who specializes in dreams. If anyone could do something like this, he could. <sighs> okay. So, even if somehow he's causing this, why does he target you, a total stranger? I have no idea. All I know is something is happening and I think this guy is causing it. Maybe I should go back there and confront him. It would be interesting to see what he has to say. Well, I think he would probably laugh and think that you're insane. I mean, think about what you're saying here. <laughs> Being confrontational with this guy isn't going to solve anything. I'm sorry, but he's not the problem. You've got the problem. Look, I'm sorry, man. Uh, but, but seriously, may, maybe you do need some professional help here. I mean, no one is controlling your dreams, and you can't go around screaming at strangers. I mean, if you think that's normal, you, you might have to... Think about things a little, you know? Think about what you're doing here. Dude! If this was happening to you, and you had not had a good night's sleep in months, and night after night, some weird guy taunts you in your dreams, and suddenly, you see this guy in real life, you would start to think some crazy things too. Yeah, well, I don't know, man. But, uh... I know you're saying some crazy ass shit. You can think whatever the hell you want, but I think this guy is the key to everything, and I'm gonna do whatever it takes to find out why. <laughs> Look, if you insist on doing this, then at least let me come along for your safety and for his. I don't know. I got a lot to think about. I'll let you know what I decide to do. <laughs> That's great. You do that. Yeah. I think I'm gonna get going. I've got a lot on my mind and everything.
Hey, man, be careful. I'm worried about you. Don't worry. I'll be fine. Really, take care of yourself. I will. See you later. Yeah, look, um, I know you said not to call, but, uh, you really have to know about something. Uh, dude, he knows, alright? Yeah, and, and he's coming after you right now. Well, I see that you have returned. Would you like to come in? Yes. How can I help you? Tell me something. Do you know me? Have we met before? Not that I know of. Well then, why do you appear in my dreams? Do I really? And what do I do in them? You laugh and taunt me without mercy. <laughs> and I've come here to find out why you are in my dreams. The mind can do strange things. Who knows? Well, I was thinking that you just might know something considering that you seem to be a psychic that specializes in dreams. I don't think you want to know. You couldn't handle it. Furthermore, I'll only tell you what I want you to know. Like hell you will! Now I don't know what the hell is happening to me, or what the hell you're talking about, but I do know this! This shit stops now! Or what? I could make you go completely insane from never sleeping. You are pretty much well on your way already. Or, I could finally let you have some rest. But remember, it's only up to me. Oh yeah? Well, I think I have another option. One that I could finally get some rest and put a stop to everything. I could kill you. Ugh. Ugh. See, I thought we'd be a little bit more evenly matched in the waking world, but even so, I brought something just in case. Look, killing me won't stop it. Well, I'll let you know how that turns out.
See? Things are going a little different than usual, aren't they? <clears throat> I was just following orders, doing as I was told. No! This is the end! Now it's over! What? What have I done? Operator, get me there, police. I'd like to report murder. Hello? Yes, this is him. Yeah, I know him. We're good friends, yeah. He murdered someone? Oh, he, he's at a mental hospital. Oh, wow. Well, yeah, you know, his, uh, his behavior has been erratic lately. He, uh told me about some delusions he had been having about someone controlling his dreams. No, no, I didn't think he was capable of anything like this. Well, at least he's uh, getting the care that he needs. Yes, sir, I'd be more than happy to answer any questions you may have. I can meet with you tomorrow, no problem. Yes, thank you for informing me of this tragedy. Ha 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 ha!